video number 300. 300, or in Thailand they say Sunray. 300 videos. Never thought I'd go this far. My first video started off as, I think it was nine seconds long. I was just showing someone a market in Thailand. I think I saw a video that day, Matt Monarch just loading up his durian full of plastic bags. And I was like, well, you, know, you don't have to use plastic if you don't want to. You can just take the durian and eat it in the park. So Matt Monarch inspired me and freely inspired me to get YouTube happening. And this is where it's become today. Most popular YouTube channel for vegan, simple living, weight loss, how to do a raw foods diet, fruit based, things like that. How to succeed, being slim for life, how to get super fit, how to get elite fitness with no drugs, just good food, early nights, lots of sleep, things like that. So I, I can't believe it's gone so far. I can't believe I'm earning an income from YouTube. That's the crazy part of it all. I'm doing what I do anyway, and now I'm earning considerable money for it. I can't exactly say how much because they're pretty tight with that, but uh, it's pretty impressive. I'm pretty, pretty stoked, pretty grateful that my viewers value my opinion so much. Even the haters, they keep coming back for more and more, and I do it for you guys and girls out there because without the viewers, nothing's happening, nothing's happening. There's no motivation if I have no viewers to put stuff out there. And I started off, I think I had 10 viewers in the first week on my first ever YouTube channel and things like that. So my tip is to start today. Start YouTube today. Don't wait. Don't wait. Now's the time. Make a video. As soon as this one's finished, make a video in what you're passionate about and put it up. And if you get 10, if you get 11 views in a week, you got one more view than me. You got 10% more views than me in your first week. So start small, aim high. So YouTube's fantastic for sharing your opinion. And I've watched people, watch the superfood infomercial gurus just huckster people. And I'm like, that's wrong. That's wrong. And I'm going to stand up and I'm going to speak up about it versus being all fakey, flaking. Say, no judgment, just stand there. And that's what people love about me. They say, the Harley. You're so ruthless, you're so badass, you get up there and you don't give a fuck, you just tell it how it is and we thank you for that. So I'll continue to do that because that's what people expect of me and I enjoy doing that and it needs to be said because there's no one else out there saying blah 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 blah. Everyone's like too professional. So hopefully I inspire other people to stand up and say, hey, this is wrong, we won't tolerate that behavior anymore, this is how it's got to be, thanks. You don't have to punch people in the face but you've got to stand up and speak up and just tell people, hey, this is wrong man, your behavior is out of line. You're out of line. You cannot do this. You cannot sell this. You cannot promote that anorexia, orthorexia anymore. It's got to stop. But that's, yeah, so today's the 300th video. Thanks for being so supportive over the years. My YouTube channel is went like this in views. <laughs> just stagnating, stagnating, stagnating. And this year, just took off like a freaking mango tree on some crazy fertilizer. Just up. So just expect two or three years of nothing. And then boom. It's taken us years and years. Literally, I spend at least 50 to 70 hours a week on average on the net. Definitely. For like consistency for the last five, six years. Just banging it out. Freely as well. Just banging it out. And just making sure we get to bed on time. Because it's, it's easier to get up at 6am or 7am, jump on the computer and be on the computer till, till midnight. Uh, but that's not healthy. So we try and get up. And crank out the internet in the morning and then try and you know, turn the computers off at six, seven, eight o'clock at night so we can go to bed. So we just, that's how we've become successful. It's just hard work and being truthful, being honest and just telling people what we really feel versus being fake and flaky. Because everyone's, that's, that's too common now. That's too common. Look at Kevin Gianni's channel. It's like a ghost town now. People are, are sick of the, the flakiness and all that crap. They want honest truth. So if you want to make it in the scene, 2011. Truth's where it's at, man. Truth is in trend. Truth is in fashion. Versus telling people good things about their bad habits. I mean, that's that's just old. That's boring. That's the old paradigm. The new paradigm now, health, fitness, vitality, feeling great, being slim, no drugs, drug-free, making your life count for something, being loving to the animals and the planet without killing them, things like that. That's what's trendy.